Welcome to Dell Tech Support. There are many different settings available in Windows 10 to help extend battery life. Today we'll go over these power settings and we'll also talk about the difference between hibernate and sleep. In the start menu search box, type power and select power and sleep settings. Here is where you can find the time controls for turning off just the screen or for putting your PC into sleep mode. You can do both for when your computer is running on the battery and when it is plugged in. The settings can be from one minute up to never and are for the amount of time you decide your PC to be idle before these power options go into effect. To go even deeper, click on additional power settings to open a new window where you have many other options but most settings do overlap. Customize is like creating your own plan and change plan settings is the same as power sleep settings but you can also adjust the brightness level. Choose what the power button does and choose what closing the lid does have the exact same setting options each one has the choice to do nothing, sleep, hibernate, and shut down, but for the power button, there is also turn off the display. You may need to enable the hibernate option, which you can do by clicking on change settings that are currently unavailable, and check hibernate. After you're all done, save these changes. Sleep versus hibernate. Going into sleep mode puts the PC into a low energy state in which the PC is on standby and uses the minimum amount of power necessary. It stops all your actions and puts them into memory for a quick restart. Hibernate actually shuts down your computer and saves everything you were doing to the hard disk. Once turned back on, it resumes where you left off. Hibernation mode is good for when you don't plan on using your PC for an extended period of time, while sleep mode is good for those instances when you stop working for a short time. Whenever you have questions or need help, reach out to us through social media on Facebook or Twitter, or join in a chat on the Dell Community Forum. Be sure to check out our other tutorials available on this channel, and if you like this video, give it a like, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching!